sure it's him. Oh, God damn it. Okay. Get your ass home in one piece, MJ. You all right? Far fucking from it. Sinclair Paris. That mean anything to you? Nothing good. For black folks, anyway. Sheriff Department down there still thinks Jim Crow is the law of the land, so we're building a civil rights case against him. Been working with an attorney out of Washington, D.C., knows people in the FBI. Is that what that call was about? One of my men, named Ezekiel Dandridge, was down there meeting with folks, getting them to agree to testify against the Sheriff's Department. He was compiling evidence, uh, testimony, getting folks' names. We we're gonna turn it over to that attorney. <sighs> then he ran into a motherfucker named Sheriff Walter Slim Beaumont. I was on the phone with him when it happened. I'm getting ready to leave now. I know. Yeah. Okay. Kind of laid out, ain't it? Are you having car trouble? No, sir. Everything's fine. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, why don't you come on out here and let me get a look at you? What you doing around Sinclair this time of night? Passing through, sir. Passing through. That's nice. It's a beautiful night for passing through, ain't it? Who's that on the phone? My mama. Your mama. She worries. Just letting her know when to expect me. That's mighty nice. I bet she appreciates that. Yes, sir. It is a beautiful night. <laughs> Don't let me keep it. Especially what with your mama waiting and all. Jesus. And another brother falls. Lincoln, this is my daughter Roxy. She grew up in Atlanta with her mother. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Lincoln. Lincoln Clay, I know. Daddy, I already told you I can handle this on my own. There's too much at stake. The case, people's lives. Can't take any chances. Heard you ripped Dixie Mafia a new asshole. <laughs> Left one of them hanging from a Ferris wheel. He killed someone close to me. Seemed like a good way to pay him back. Slim and them motherfuckers who work for him. Dixie Mafia ain't nothing compared to them. We do this, you do what I say, when I say it. Yes, ma'am. Uh, the two of you need to get on down to Sinclair Parish and get that folder. When you got it, bring it here. <laughs> Meet me outside when you're ready to go. Your ass is driving. She was supposed to be with Ezekiel. Blames herself for what happened. Blame's an easy thing to put on. Hell of a lot harder to take off. We'll get this done. Of that, I have no doubt. Sinclair Parish? <laughs> yeah, I, I remember Sinclair Parish. <laughs> you, you need to understand that back then, uh, 
local police, sheriff departments, they operated with absolute impunity. And no one operated with more impunity than Sheriff Walter Beaumont. Beaumont used his power to keep Sinclair Parish white. Places like that were called sundown counties. If you were black and caught around there after dark, well, that would be the last time anyone ever saw you. Well, let's go. My pops gave me the rundown on how you two fucked up those dicky assholes. What you did to do set, that was stone cold. Did what had to be done. Yeah, I'm sure you did. But listen, if one of these Sinclair deputies ever tries to pull you over, don't stop. They'll kill you and me without a thought. New Bordeaux police don't exactly walk around giving black folks hugs. Now, I ain't no disrespect, my brother. But take out Slim like you did Richie Doucette, and in their minds, that's just gonna justify everything they be doing. That's gonna make shit even worse. But you, you ready to just go out and kill them all, huh? No, just the ones that matter. Shit, you know. 222 on County Road. Suspicious driver identified. Backup request. Pull over. Available units. Step on. Seriously? Move, man, move. Shit. Let me try. Oh, she wanted to keep a low profile. Yeah, well, he on our ass now, so a low profile done come and gone. Now get us the fuck out of here. Yes, ma'am. I've dealt with asshole cops before, but god damn. They'd rather ice your black ass as soon as look at you. Now I get what you've been saying. Those motherfuckers are a whole new brand of intense. And keep your eyes open for more pigs as we head through town. MJ Farmer's up ahead. What's MJ like? Sinclair born and raised. He a white boy looking to make a difference. You trust him? Of course I trust him. Although I think he got more balls than sense. Sounds like my kind of people. Just sit up here? Yes. Roxy, Roxy. I ain't seen you in a good minute, girl. MJ's waiting for y'all in the greenhouse. Now you say hey to Lula and them babies for me. They need a place to lay low, send them my way. Look after yourself. Ain't you two a shot to behold? <laughs> yeah, we just a regular old beauty and the beast. Lincoln here is beauty. Name's Mish, but most folks call me MJ. How's the drive in? 
I've got a warm welcome from the Sinclair Sheriff's Department. Goddamn assholes. Since the thing was EQ, Slim's had them high alert. And when'd you get back? A few months ago. This is my ticket home. Lost part of my stomach? It was about a year ago. Shrapnel? Hewitt got hit by an RPG. And next thing I know, I'm on the ground with part of the tail rotor sticking out of me. This helps with the pain. <coughs> God damn. Some of my best work. That cop friend of yours got us a line on our missing folder. Mickey? Yeah. Told me Slim's got it locked up down at the station. Don't suppose there's an easy way in and out of there? No, not unless you're invisible. Hmm. Them motherfuckers don't leave much chance. So I should probably wait until it's dark. Try to get in when most of those assholes have gone home for the day. That's what I was thinking. Slim's a slippery bastard. Unpredictable. So I'm gonna tag along and help keep an eye on things. I'm gonna be waiting for you outside. Appreciate it. And MJ? You might want to get in touch with that cop friend of yours. Tell him to call in sick. Oh, that motherfucker's long gone. station usually a skeleton crew this time of night. Surprised you didn't go in and snatch the files yourself. I thought about it, but I suppose you deserve to have a little fun. Ain't you generous. Don't fret. I'll be keeping a bird's eye view on things from nearby. Give you a heads up any way I can. There's me up here. Cool. I'll grab the files. Where should we meet? I can make my way back to the phone. And Lincoln, keep your head down, all right? Since the day I was born. I rigged up something so I can talk to you through your earpiece. Them pigs in the station will shoot you on sight. So, you know. Good luck. God knows what kind of action's going on on the hood. You touch that car? I'm in position on the roof. So. Got eyes on you. Oh, and a small handful of deputies around the station. Any place you work. Office here? It's on the second floor. Playing hide and seek with you.
Roxy, I got it. Well, goddamn. Don't act too surprised. Oh, I ain't. But this shit ain't over till you get your ass back to the farmhouse. And I mean alive. That's the plan. Meet you there. I was wondering when you was gonna show up. You doubt this boy from the hollow? Let's just say I'm still surprised you ain't fuck it up. Give me time. I'm sure I'll find a way. Slim made some notes inside. Highlighted a few names. Fuck. Slim already gone to work. Some of these people done gone missing. Which means they're probably dead. He knows the names of the people we've been talking to. God damn it, we've been working at this for almost a year, putting everything together piece by piece for it to all fall apart now. Ain't nothing falling apart. We always knew the motherfuckers hit back. These folks gave their life thinking we was gonna see this through. We still got the pictures, the written testimony. We ain't gonna let Slim worm his way out of this. So, what's our next move? I'm gonna call the folks on this list and tell them to get the fuck out of St. Clair. After that, we gonna see about Slim and his asshole friends. Goddamn back. Man, I could really use a little help bringing a couple of bags of fertilizer in. No problem. Like it? Any old asshole can grow some skunkweed in their backyard. It takes an artist to get in there, start mixing strains and shit. Gotta respect a man with a passion. Been growing long? Since I got back. VA shrink said I was suffering from intrusive thoughts. Couldn't get down with the meds he gave me. So I started growing. Shared my first crop with some friends. And word travels fast. Good weed does that. Cops? Yeah, cops are so focused on keeping St. Clair white, they haven't noticed the new shade of green popping up. <laughs> Lucky you. Plus, I kind of got a referral system, so I don't have to worry about any old asshole talking to the so cops. So you got a pipeline in the new Bordeaux? Nah. You know someone who might be interested? I might. We'll talk more once things settle down around here. Thank you for the help. Want to take a hit? You shouldn't have. Fuck. You put your foot in this, boy. Goddamn right. Well, let me see if Roxy needs help digging through the files. That could take a minute. Enjoy that. We should talk business later. Thank you. 
Hope you packed a coat, man, because there's a goddamn ship blizzard headed our way. Got in touch with everybody in there except three people. Andy Lafayette, Gina Paulson, Eddie Hanahan. Slim cornered him, cut him off. Only a matter of time for he moved in. And that's just the start of it. Whole parish is locked down. No one gets in or out without Slim say so. Like I said, it's a ship blizzard. The fuck we gonna do? Those three, you know where they at? Yeah, we got somebody watching them. If you charge in guns blazing, it's just gonna get them killed. But if Roxy and I pick up a ride, bust around Sinclair kicking up dust, motherfuckers ain't gonna be able to resist a chance to hook a couple niggas on the run. Exactly. And while all eyes are on us, MJ steals around town, grabs those three, and brings them back here. You think you can handle that? Fuck yeah, I can. Got something else that'll help. My night crawl. Ezekiel was driving her when he got got. We steal her back? Ain't no way she ain't gonna turn heads. What's the impound lot like? About what you expect, man. Cops, alarms, big ass fence. Ain't like we trying to bust into the Federal Reserve or something. <laughs> yeah, right. I gotta go call my old man, tell him what's going on. You come find me when you're ready to head out. All right. Well, fucking shit, Blizzard. Get the witnesses. Keep your head down, MJ. 10 4 stats, Sergeant. No. Here. <sighs> Blanket here, Pop. I'll call you when we're done. You ready? Come on. What the hell? Let's go get my car. That talk from your dad? You can say that. He wanted to remind me of the self-sufficiency of a revolutionary black woman. <laughs> His black ass way of saying don't get shot. <laughs> well, he ain't wrong. So what's the plan for getting your car? It starts on a dead man switch, I think. Who needs a dead man switch in their car? Lincoln, I'm parcel to my wheels. Point is, I'm the only one that can get my baby started. So you and me need to get into that lot I'll get up running, and we'll get moving. Probably gonna set off some alarms. Yeah, well, that'll be our cue to haul ass out of there. You know what? We should keep our heads low while we inside. Let's sneak in, get my car, and try not to get shot. MJ, you ready? Not ready. Good. We're fixing to raise a little hell. Give you time to get the first witness. Let us know where you got him. 10-4 star sergeant. I'll be in touch. Let's tear up Sinclair. MJ, do your thing. Time to see what kind of damage your car can do, Roxy. Hold up on the way. Where'd that motherfucker come from? Lincoln, look out! You! They called they friends. Kill! They called they friends. Uh. 
More rednecks rolling in. Four of them on the way. Full of assholes coming up. There ain't no end of these good old boys. There ain't no end of these good old boys. Yeah! Don't worry about dinging my baby. She can take it. There's a billboard in town for Slim's re-election campaign. Worst ways to get the sheriff's department's attention. As long as you don't mind me scratching the paint a little. Who that coming up? There ain't no end of these good old boys. Cute! They call they friends. No end of these good old boys. Just outside of town. It sounds like you're proposing we drive through a mess of deputies just so they'll call in more pissed off cops. Shit, girl, you know how to have a good time. Uh, Sheriff Slim Beaumont reaching out to our new guests. Don't even know if y'all can hear me. We ain't used to our cuz being this rambunctious in St. Clair. Now I'm looking forward to giving y'all an education. Laying down some law and order. Sheriff Beaumont out. Humble ass! Whoa! <laughs> Yo, they called they friends. VIP retreat. Thanks for sending out the welcome party. There ain't no enemy to the next boy. Oh, I'm on the way. More rednecks rolling in. Cute. They call they friends. Pass Holy through this shit. place. Holy shit. Stuck back here. The night rollers in the outside facility. Get your asses over here. Plenty of shit to blow up around here. I say we get to it. Car full of assholes coming up. This is Sheriff Beaumont. Any one of my deputies gonna deal with this fucking plague of Negro? Now here go another. There ain't no. Some bitch is shooting at the dispatch station. Give me some backup over here. Look at you, soldier boy. Don't stop. Keep your butt down. That's good enough. Now let's get the hell out of here. Slim's using the county fair for a little re-election party. We hit that, it'll piss Slim off and the fuckers looking to keep him in office. Officer, take attention. Arms up, taking the last of the night ball to take the off-side facility. All you in your march immediately! Oscar Mike with the VIP in the back. Coming up. Moving on to the next one. Through that motherfucker! 
Oh, but this is Sheriff Beaumont here with a message for our new friend. Thought y'all could buffalo slam, didn't you? But don't worry, I got some for y'all. Mow up on the way! Mow up on the way! <laughs> Who that coming up? for you. MJ, you wily motherfucker. Didn't I tell you? Mo balls and sense. We ought to regroup at the farm. You driving your baby? <laughs> Goddamn right. Look like you half knew how to drive. Thanks, Roxy. I'll see you back at the farm. Need to get him to LaVos ASA yesterday. Tell Roxy we're ready when she is. You got it. Hey. Hey, and he gonna be okay? Well, lucky for him, yours truly has a bit of field medicine training. Can thank my old man for that. Gonna ride with MJ, do my best to keep him comfortable. Well, y'all better haul ass. Only a matter of time before Slim and his boys sniff this place out. Let's roll, Roxy. Shit. The folder, can you grab it from the house? Sure thing. I'll meet you back at Laveau's with it. Oh, 
Boy, I spent long hours thinking about putting a bullet in your head. But then it can't. Why not hand you over to my friends here? And let them take the time with you. Looks like your cracker-ass friends decided to bust out the Halloween costumes, eh, Slim? Ah. Didn't I tell y'all this one was special? <laughs> your people split, boy. Sure, they might have gotten a few witnesses out of St. Clair. But this, this is what's really important. Without it, it's just gonna be the word of some goddamn niggas against the word of a God-fearing white man. After it's all said and done, hell, <laughs> I'll probably get elected governor. Glad to see you haven't lost your ambition. <laughs> you know what the problem with you people is? You still think you can win. That you got something to win. But it ain't never gonna come to pass. Once a filthy nigger, always a filthy nigger. Go on. Have your fun. Go oh, still, motherfucker. God damn, where'd that come from? when we were driving out. Come on! 
anything but letting you live making you answer for the shit you've done that's where the change begins besides you got a figure being a wide racist Cops gonna make you real popular on the cell block. <laughs> nah. I know people. I know powerful people. I ain't, ain't going no. Nowhere. Time we get the hell out of Sinclair Parish. Let's go and get Slim back to my dad's place. Slim boys is coming up on us. Y'all hollow cats don't fuck around. Don't you let them fuckers trash my car!
Don't you rise up, baby! Woo! Slim is losing his friends fast! You is fucking with the wrong black girl, motherfucker! We got company on our ass! Ah. Get it on up back to my dad's place. He gonna be happy to hear about Slim. Hey, you up, Rox? <sighs> be a hell of a lot better when we get Slim Bowman under lock and key. He did real good, Lincoln Clay. Just park us up ahead. Ah! Watch the paint! Watch the paint! Where do you want Slim? I'm gonna take it from him. Go and check in with my dad. He need to know what's going on. <laughs> Son, sooner or later you're gonna have to learn how to duck. <laughs> Beaumont. He's still breathing. His ass is out in the garage. Roxy handled herself all right. Shit. <laughs> She was better than all right. That girl is bad, Laveau. Uh-huh. Well, you did your part. So you gonna stick around? We could use your help. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> you always got a place for the slinker. It was nice seeing you again, Laveau. Sooner or later, you gonna have to live your life again. Don't forget that. Come in. Hey, and now, just wanted to say, you okay? Yeah. So. Actually, no. I ain't okay. Part of me wonders if any of this gonna even matter. We take out that motherfucker slim, and all I see is pain, ugliness, in the world. Someone once told me that if all you look for in the world is evil, it's all you're ever gonna see. Truth is, Roxy Laveau, you are one of the brightest lights I have ever known. Don't let the world take that away from you. Dance with me. Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't really did. Okay. Maybe just one. So, if I'm so bright, then what are you? I'm not sure I can answer that. You sell yourself too short. You do. You think all you got is brute force. But there'd be a light inside you, too, Lincoln Clay. How you know that? Well, because you here dancing with me. Roxy. To follow your heart. Yeah. 
you follow your heart. I know 